Yo, what is going on YouTube? This is Technically T here, and today I'm bringing you another case review for the iPhone 10. I can't say another case review, but it's a bunch of cases for the iPhone 10, and these are cases from Nomad. So I do want to give a huge shout out to Nomad. Um, reaching out to me via email, asked me do I want to get some of their cases to review. I say a sure thing because if you don't know Nomad, you need to get to know them guys because they make excellent, excellent top quality cases, especially when it comes to genuine leather. So the three cases that we have today is the clear folio, we have the rugged case, which I really like, and we also have the card case for the iPhone 10. So let's go ahead and jump into them. Let's start off with the rugged case, guys, because I did open this and I really, really like the rugged case and I might actually be using it on my 10, but we will see. But guys, here is the packaging from Nomad, very nice, Premium package, guys. Nomad rugged case, iPhone 10, extra tough frame, up to 10 feet of drop protection, guys. And you do get that genuine Horween leather. Since 1905, there is a picture of the case. Flip it over on the back, guys. And as you can see, with genuine leather, you do that get that patina over time that actually wears. Some people don't like it. Some people do like it. I think it actually ages your phone well. It ages your accessories well and actually adds to the uh, to the flavor of the iPhone, guys. So if you like that, if, if you don't, this is the type of case you're dealing with. You're dealing with real deal leather, and that's what real leather does over time. But, guys, let's go ahead and get into the case. So it's basically a slide out here. Pop it out of the case, guys. On the inside, not much. It lets you know. You can pause it and read it for yourself, guys. Just lets you know about the quality leather that those guys over at Nomad uses. So here it is, guys. Rugged case for the iPhone 10. What you have is your leather back here, and on the inside, you have a very felt, nice design. This actually will help pretty good, guys, so it don't really scratch your iPhone on the inside. And along the outsides of the case, guys, you have a very, very stiff, TPU rubber material, which I already feel this case will fit actually excellent, guys. So let's go ahead and pop the 10 in, see how it actually fits. And right offhand, guys, I can already tell it fits super good. So let's go around the case. So on that right side, guys, you do have that raised power button there. Flip it over on the bottom, you have all your cutouts for your lightning adapter and your speakers. On, let's go ahead and get it unlocked. On the left side, volume up, volume down, nice and tactile, no issues there. Mute toggle switch, not the easiest to get to, but it's in there, it's not horrible. Flipping over on your back, guys, you have that cutout for your camera and your flash, and you see it is recessed, and you should be good to go when you lay it on his back to actually not scratch it. Next, lay on the table protection, guys. Now, looking at this case, guys, it does offer up to 10 feet of drop protection, and as you see, there is a tiny uh, raised lip that raises above the iPhone 10 screen. As you guys know, I do run a tempered glass, as always, and it still does have a slight lip over the screen. Next, how does it actually fit on the phone, guys? And I can already tell you, this case fits great. As you can see, guys, I'm pulling on the edges. No give whatsoever. Top and bottom, yeah, you're always gonna get a little give when it comes to the bottom, guys, but it is, it is very forgiving. Pops right back in place. Very satisfying click, guys. And once this case is on, this case is not going anywhere, guys. It actually fits the iPhone 10, complements it very, very well. So I really, really like this case for the iPhone 10. Next, how does it feel in your hand? The leather back combined with the very stiff rubber shell going all the way around, guys, feels very good in your hands. It feels very premium. Premium case with a premium phone, you already know how it's gonna feel all together, guys. But it, in hand, doesn't add too much bulk. Feels very good and keeps a fairly thin profile when you're thinking about the overall phone. So this is the rugged case for the iPhone 10. Now, one thing about it, I'm not sure how I feel about it being a rugged case with a leather back. That's kind of fighting against each other. But hey, I mean, if you want to beat the leather up a little bit, if you're one of those rough guys and you want to beat the leather up a little bit, then go for it. I think I might run it for a little bit, guys, and see how it actually ages over time. I think it might age very well, and it might look good just to beat up rubber. I mean, to beat up uh, leather on the back. If, you buy, if you're running, thinking about running this case, you can't worry about the leather on the back getting scratched or anything like that because that's something that's just going to happen over time, guys. So this is the rugged case for the iPhone 10. Now, this case will run you 44 
$95, I think, on their website, guys. So, of course, I will drop the link. Well, Siri's always trying to talk. Of course, I will drop the link to that one in the description. Moving along, guys, we have the Nomad card case for the iPhone 10. Looking at the case, guys, let's get a couple details. Let's actually read this because I don't have any cards uh, readily available for me to pop them on. But as you see, guys, it takes up to four cards. Six feet of drop protection on this one, guys. So not as much as the rugged case that offered 10. This does offer six feet, but hey, some is better than none. Flip it over on the back, guys. Same deal when it comes to the leather. So let's go ahead and slide it out. Let's see how it fits. Now, I think this case is basically the rugged series case, guys, just with card slots. As you see, you have a card slot there, and you also have another card slot there. Literally, it is the exact same case as the rugged. Like I said, just has two slots for some cards, guys. So we're not really going to go around it too much. Same raise power buttons, raise volume buttons, cut out for that mute toggle. Everything is basically the same. Let's go ahead and pop it on. Same exact case, guys. Lay on tear protection, A1. Fit, of course, fitting super duper tight when it comes to that fit. Next, how does it fit in your hand? Feels exactly like the rugged case, guys. This is nothing but a rugged case with a card holder. So if you do like the rugged case and say you want to switch it up and use this as a card holder when you're going out or something like that, then this would, would you know this would be a great option for you. Fits up to four cards, so two and two, you can rock out and be good to go, guys. But this is the Nomad card case for the iPhone 10. Very high quality case. Very nice feeling in hand. Once again, excellent job, Nomad, on that one. So let's go ahead and slide this back in the case. I like to keep, some people throw boxes and stuff around, guys. Some of these cases like this, I like to actually keep in the box because I don't want to throw a leather case around. Next, we have the clear folio for the iPhone 10, guys. Slim design, this holds up to six cars, so you get even more cars, guys. You have a cash slot. You don't get any level of drop protection, but that's what you come to expect when dealing with a folio type case. So let's go ahead and slide this out. See how it actually uh, uh, actually does, guys. I know a lot of people, you know, likes these folio cases. They're all pretty good. I forgot to actually test the other cases out with wireless charging, guys. We'll do that at the end. So here it is, guys. Clear folio. I think this is basically like a clear rugged case. Once again, all clear on the sides. You do get a matte frosted type material, guys, which I think will provide a great level of grip. You get that high quality leather on this cover here. And also you get these car slots. One, two, three. And it says it holds up to three, no, six cars. So two, two, two in each. You get some Nomad branding here. As it says, the Horween leather company there. And look on the inside, guys. You do get a card slot here and it basically just lets you know some more of the details about the actual leather so let's go ahead and pop this phone here in the case and here it is guys very very nice once again super tight fitting when it comes to the clear case guys once again this is basically like another rugged series case with a folio attached to it now what Nomad should do, guys, is make a clear case. I think that will look extremely dope. This case right here alone, take that leather part off, that case alone will look very good, especially with that matte frame going around it. Now, one thing I like about, and as you see, looking at the back, guys, completely transparent to show off the color of your iPhone. Your camera is protected there. The fit is A1 in here, guys, not budging. This is what I come to expect when dealing with Nomad cases. One thing I would like to see, guys, though, is having some type of magnet or something that actually keeps this closed because one thing about it is just going to keep flopping open and sometimes that can be an annoyance. So in all wallet cases, guys, I always would like to see um, some type of hinge or something like that that will actually keep the wallet portion of it closed. So, guys, this is the clear folio case for the iPhone 10. Now, let's bring them all back in scale for a minute. And let's bring the wireless charging over here because that's always a big question. Do these work with wireless charging? As you see, the clear folio works with wireless charging. <clears throat> always got to verify you guys. So I'm going to pop these back on real quick. And I'm sure all of them were wireless charging, guys, but I just want to show you and be done with it. As you see, charging up there. <clears throat> done there, wireless charging. That case there. 
Let's bring out the rugged here. Put that in there. Ah, got stuff all over the place right now. <clears throat> Boom. All three work with wireless charging, guys. So, once again, these are the Nomad Basically Suite. We have the rugged case here. We have the rugged card case. And we do have the clear folio. This case will run you $44.95 with the rugged. These two will run you $39.95 on Nomad's website but as always guys i will drop the link to these products down in the description give this video a big huge thumbs up if you like it comment subscribe and i'll see you on the next one later